Hey guys, it's Kyle from Kyle Raps here, and today uh, we are going to be learning how to add uh, view transitions to your apps. So let's get straight into it. Uh, go ahead and open up Xcode and create a new project. Make sure this is a single view application, and we're going to call this Whoops. Um, create this to the desktop for easy access. And as always, I have the uh, code for you guys. I spelled a lot wrong there. Let's change that. And that's how you change the name of your project. <laughs> uh, that's not actually the tutorial. Um, let's uh, go ahead and open up the... Actually, no, sorry, we have to put in a new file. So go ahead and right-click the project and select New File. Make sure it is the Objective-C class. And make sure this is set to UI View Controller. Target it, no, sorry, with XIB for your user interface. Call this second view controller. Okay, now save this just inside the uh, uh, project here. And we'll keep that there. Go ahead in both of the uh, projects, just keep the status bars the same in one, only change that one, and both the uh, same size here. So first what thing we need to do is go to the .h in the first view, and open up the brackets. Now outside them in the action section, go ahead and write IP action. And we're going to call this switch back. Actually, just switch. So, change that. And that. Um, make sure you have the semicolon. Next thing, go into the .h, I mean, sorry, .m file. And type the same thing, only with uh, the brackets. Um, inside here, just go ahead and write sorry, we actually have to import the uh, second view controller, so hashtag import with the quotations, and in here write second view controller dot h inside here just go ahead and write uh, second, or at least start, and it should pop up immediately. Uh, so type that and start second equals open up to uh, second view controller, and then set this to right. close one, only one. In here, just write in it with name, name, write nil and nil for the bundle and the name. Close one and a semicolon. Um, next, you want to write second and then star, no, sorry, dot model. Transition style equals UI model. Whoops. Yeah. 
And here you want to choose these styles. So you can choose from four styles, the vertical, uh, cover vertical, sorry, or the cross dissolve, flip horizontal, or partial curl. Um, let's go with cross dissolve for the first one. Go ahead and write semicolon, next line, self, present, model view controller, and then write second, animate it, yes, close, and a semicolon. So now all we need to do is just copy this into the uh, second dot M here, and of course write it in here. And now let's go connect them. Actually, let's first to, first let's uh, change this here. So let's change this to partial curl. Okay, so just drag in a round direct button. And we're going to call this back to first view. And we'll make that a tiny bit bigger and center it. And go to the uh, first view, drag in a round direct button, and center that completely. Uh, move to next view and of course we have to capitalize because it looks better um, let's make this one bigger and more noticeable center and next uh, in the first uh, view controller here go ahead to file zoner and then connections drag the switch to the uh, round direct button and select touch up inside do the same for the uh, second view controller As you notice, this one is gray and this one is white to, uh, to see the difference as well as the status bars are different. So now let's go ahead and run this on the simulator. Wait for it to load. Ding. So, as you can see, there's a round rack button that says move to next view. So, let's go ahead and select that. And as you see, it cross dissolved. So, now when we select uh, back to first view, it will partial curl and you have that. So, that would be like for the map, uh, the maps app, you would have that selected to a button or the uh, toolbar. Um, and we can go back and it will just keep going and going and going. It will get darker. Let's see how dark we can get it. But yeah, that is pretty funny if we select that so many times. Um, anyway, that is how to get view translate, uh, sorry, translation, trans, you know, uh, in your app. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and please subscribe for all of my future, past, and present videos. Um, well, duh, present because I'm making one right now, but anyway, um, I hope you liked it, and please leave in the comment section below for any video suggestions you have for me. You could also Skype or Facebook me, just search up uh, for Skype, Kyle Greenlaw, and for Facebook, just uh, uh, Cairo Apps. Um, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Peace.